In this training video, you're going to experience what has never been done before. This is the next level when it comes to quickly mastering topspin. So buckle up and let's get going. You can actually develop really good topspin technique in just a few minutes. But we know that the stroke begins to break down when the ball starts traveling away from the center of the strings. Our research shows 80% of balls at the recreational level are being mishit. So it's not the footwork, it's not the wind, it's not even the technique that affects hitting the center of the strings. Because you could be falling backwards and hit the center of the strings, and you could be in perfect position with excellent footwork and shank the ball. Everything depends on your eye, and that's where Topspin Plus comes in. So I'm gonna guide you through a training session here, and I just want you to understand that as you begin to practice this, you're gonna develop excellent topspin technique being able to hit the ball in the center of the strings more often with great rhythm and timing. And probably the best part is you're going to start to become your own coach and correct miss hits much, much faster so that you don't have to take a lot more of expensive tennis lessons. So let's get right into it and go through the four steps together. The first thing we're going to do is get the technique down and the plane of the stroke. And this is the easy part. As you can see, your ball spins. So get this feel and right away, you're gonna be building in the correct technique for the top spin stroke. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna visualize because that's what all great ball strikers do before they hit the ball. This allows your eye to stay on the ball until after it leaves your strings. So pick a spot on the wall if you're inside. That spot should be, you know, around the height that you'd be aiming your shot for if you were on the court. Take a mental snapshot of that spot, like the best players do before hitting, and visualize it as you go through your reps at a medium speed here on a still ball just like this. You wanna do this five to 10 times or until you get 80% of them feeling solid, and then we'll go to step two. In step two, you're gonna get that top spin stroke synced up with your timing and your footwork. So this is a slow moving ball on a six count. And what you wanna make sure you're always hitting the ball with a medium swing speed as it's coming towards you, shooting for 80% solid. This is where we get the plus because not only are you memorizing the perfect topspin technique in the crucial last three feet, you're gonna have perfect timing for the ball to be able to land in the center of your strings and working your footwork. Come on, how's that for plus? So do this for 25 to 50 reps until you're at about eight out of 10 solid hits making sure that you're visualizing on each shot. If you can do that, see if you can then alternate forehands and backhands like this, visualizing each time, and then we'll go to step three. In step three, we're gonna get your top spin strokes ready for the court. So this is gonna be fast paced here on a three count. Nothing different from step two other than now there's no conscious thinking at all. You're on autopilot. Visualize that spot on the wall before each shot, making sure that you're always hitting the ball at a medium speed, only as it comes towards you, just like this. So we're racking up a ton of reps here, so make sure that you're getting eight out of 10 of them to feel solid. This is gonna give you 150 solid reps a day in about 10 minutes, and that'll give you a thousand solid reps being stored each week. And then we'll go to step four. Here in step four, we're on the court, and here's the deal you can now trust your training. Your topspin technique is memorized, just trust it. Your timing is memorized, just trust it. And your footwork is memorized, so trust that too. Now it's about one thing and one thing only, and that's your eye. So when you miss hit, because of course you will, even the best in the world do, you've gotta understand that that mistake began with your eye, not your stroke. You only have one thing to fix. How's that for a plus plus? Looking over too soon is the most common mistake, so be on the lookout for that. As we mentioned earlier, you can be off balance and hit the sweet spot, and you can be in perfect position and shank the ball. It all depends on your eye. You don't need to think about your technique. We did that in step one. You don't need to think about your timing. That was step two, and same with footwork. All you need to do is do what the pros do and get ready to get in the best position possible as soon as possible. And when you do, visualize and trust your instincts. So as you can see, this is a super simple technique when it comes to developing exceptional topspin. But here's the deal. Repetition is the mother of skill, obviously. So what you need to do is practice steps one through three for about five minutes a day, and then get out on court once a week for about 30 minutes. 
if you do this, you will be starting to rack up 5,000 quality repetitions over the course of five weeks. And if you do that, I guarantee you'll be able to hit exceptional topspin shots with fantastic technique much, much more often. And your friends are going to be absolutely shocked when they see you play. So I'm rooting for you. Get out there, practice your topspin technique, and I'll see you really soon.